It's the kind of beat to go. Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Joey and today we're going to be taking a look at some of these assignments. Now this was re recently released in update 3.3 .3, and I never really got into these too much. So let me go ahead and pull up mine. I actually haven't even started mine at all yet. And as you realize now, I'm actually on a uh, iPad now. I just bought an iPad mini. Thought it'd come in handy. I thought it'd be pretty fun to mess around with it. It'll help out with the videos and all that stuff. But here are the daily assignments. So we have four of them right now. And as you complete them, they'll gradually increase in difficulty according to your level. So if I can just knock all these out, then following that, we'll get some more harder ones, better rewards. So right now we're just going to be getting on common packs, but as we go on, we'll get better rewards. So as you can see, um, complete five daily assignments. Okay. Um, kill 200 drones, deploy 10 firefighters, and cover 10 humans in Stim Z. So we're going to try to knock out all three of these in a couple of attacks here. So I'm going to go ahead and actually head down to some, uh, I'm going to do some PVP today. Just kind of mix it up really quick. TBH, uh, guys, have not been doing too much PvP lately. I'm thinking about starting a new account really fresh just for fun. I'm not going to do too much on it on YouTube-wise, but just for fun. But here we go. Here's my um, main account that I had during the beta period. And I'm going to actually go ahead and swap out my team. And I'm gonna actually going to throw in for all of my kind of uh, tanky units here, which include my Lumberjacks. And my firefighter, if I can just get rid of them. Come on. There we go. I'm going to put in firefighters. So whatever firefighters I have that are somewhat leveled up, they're going in my squad. Because I have to place 10 of them down to complete the uh, daily assignment. And let's go ahead and come down here. Jeez Louise, we got so many. I don't have any more firefighters, so we're just going to be rolling with the one. And I'll bring a fire chief. I don't think that'll count, but I might as well bring him along just in case. I do have a higher level fire chief here. I probably passed one on my way up, but it is all good. So there's a fire chief there, and we are full. And see what we can borrow here. Hmm. Never complain with a machine gunner. Let's go ahead and accept fight. And let's go ahead and get rid of some units here. Overwhelming amount here. Let me go ahead and just kind of drop four of these surgeons here. I don't really need them. Two, three, four. There we go. And let me go ahead and drop. What else do I have? I don't really use handymen too much. I'm just going to drop two of those. And let's go ahead. And I think we should be good now to, to fight. All right, we're off. So we're searching for an appointment. Now, I'm actually really excited because the update 3.4, they're going to add much more depth to the PvP. They're adding many more leagues and a whole kind of revamp to the whole reward system. So I'm really excited to see how that plays out. But here we go. First couple waves here, let's go ahead and track down our objectives. They're both in the back here, so they're pretty well placed in terms of uh, having to decide where I want to place my units. Now, this is actually a little interesting. I really like this area right here because all of these guys are going to be coming down this road, turning the corner straight into these two paths. So I'm going to go ahead and put these guys right in the middle, and this is going to allow for a really perfect little area, just kind of have them all funnel in and just kind of just take them out one by one. And it's just, I don't know, we're, it allows us to put a lot of firepower there. I'm actually going to put a machine gunner there because that's going to be a great little setup. He's going to be able to just mow down tons of drones. I'm going to go ahead and put my two melee units, my lower level ones, of course. I have really level units with me. I don't even know why, but it's okay. Let me go ahead and throw down my um, fire chief here just to ensure a ton of tankiness. So once I start those waves, those guys should readjust. Now, we do have two more pads over here. Now, we can do several things. We can actually like um just sort of load up these two pads right here and that should just allow them to all funnel in now that's if we're feeling really lucky i'm gonna roll with that i'm gonna actually give that a shot i'm just gonna kind of defend everything and once i start getting some more of my uh melee units back i'm gonna go ahead and throw them down as well so let's go ahead and start those guys off now first wave is going to be coming in from this area over here looks like we're gonna have some titans and nothing else right there foreman titan and just a bunch of drones now these snipers should help kind of cause some damage to those titans that ninja assassin right there he's going to get taken out pretty quick by the outlaw outlaw desperado excuse me um the desperado is going to do really great things for us that foreman just came out of nowhere took out that wall which is kind of annoying but i'm gonna go ahead and throw down my melee units up close and allow the rest of my guys to really just go to work here and i'm gonna throw down a second uh scatter shot right there and i'm gonna go ahead and flare everyone back just a little bit to kind of give my guys just a, a few moments to sort of 
take a quick breath and just chill out. Now, a, contra a contractor would come in handy right here. Let me go ahead and throw down some more Stim Z. Now, that is actually part of our um, a daily assignment. Pour 10 Stim Z. So, whenever we get a Stim Z, definitely going to throw that down to ensure that we are just getting as much of these kind of working through these quests as much as possible. So Sim Z is almost loaded up. A lot of spitters just hanging back there. I'm not a fan of that. Now, these guys are about to get a huge overhaul. Let me see if I can just kind of move these guys. Ugh. I think my machine gunner just got taken out because he was just not being very bright. I'm going to go throw down a mall stop cocktail down on these infectors over here. Start causing some problems for them. Throw down another lumberjack up close. I'm going to go ahead and flare these guys away to just give them a second. Dr. Zom, which is heading down. Let me go ahead and throw down a firefighter and another desperado to help cause a huge amount of damage. Now, I'm going to stim them up really quick. That'll give them plenty of power to take down those titans. Got a mortician back here quickly dropped and looks like both pads were well defended the machine gunner held on the fourth tons of melee units on the right side and the left side ends up pretty good too now i love this actually i really like this display screen i don't remember this it's been a while since i've gotten to play a lot but as you can see at the bottom we did have the uh progress for our assignment so we're going to do another attack straight into it so kill 200 drones we finished that one off and that's going to get us some coins which is really nice it's going to be one of the assignments and there it is five coins i love it who doesn't like free coins so we also covered Looks like we dropped 10 Stimzies. Not too shabby. What else we get? More coins. Five more coins. So, guys, as you, as I said earlier, as we progress through these assignments, they're going to just be better and better and better rewards. So, as you can see, come back tomorrow for a new daily assignment. They will be that much more difficult. So, we just got to deploy four more firefighters. I, whoa, I did not see it. Wait. We just need to display, yeah, six more firefighters, and then we'll be pretty much good to go. And then once we get, uh, looks like we're going to need two more for tomorrow, and then we're going to get the uncommon pack. And then it's going to keep getting better. It's just kind of going to build on, <laughs> I don't really have another word, but betterness. So let me go ahead and fight here in Havana. I have my place right now, 3,401. 3, Not too good. Let's go ahead and see what we can revenge here. Uh, I don't know if I want to get into that. Don't want to get into those situations. So let's go ahead and fight with the same team. Uh, did I get any firefighters? Let me go ahead and slowly scroll through really quick, guys. Let me go check. I don't think I have any more, but I could be wrong. All right, they're not going to be there. Let's just see. Oh, we got perfect. So I'm going to go ahead and swap out one of these level one snipers. They're not really doing too much for me. And put in that other firefighter to help get us through that assignment a little bit quicker. We're going to accept. And I'm going to see. What can I borrow here? I'm going to go borrow the machine gunner just kind of be safe. So we're going to go ahead and fight here. Not the craziest team. Let's see. How's our team power compare? So they've got us beat by quite a bit, but I feel pretty confident because the units that we have leveled up are very highly leveled which is going to be very helpful for us so very similar situation over here uh however it's going to be a bit of a tighter situation it's going to be interesting to see how we kind of play out looks like there's no foreman or anything on this one so the walls will pretty much hold up a little bit stronger um let me go ahead and focus in on this area first so what we could do we could either focus in on this area spread it out a little bit but i'm not sure exactly what i'm gonna do here let me go ahead and do this. I'm going to go ahead and put those guys there. Bring these guys over just straight to the wall. I'm going to put two of my kind of shooters guy because this is where the first wave is going to be. Now, I'm going to also put down my big tank units, a sniper over there. Let's throw down two of these firefighters start getting work, start working on that assignment. So we have a lot of melee, a huge melee front right there with several gunners to help sort of help out a little bit more. I'm also going to put the machine gunner back here to help support as well. So I can move the machine gunner into a better area. Good enough. All right, so we're going to go ahead and start those waves and I'm going to put down a lumberjack right there just to kind of hold down the fort while we work on taking out these first guys and some of our units refresh. So melee guys go right off the bat. We're, they're going down pretty fast because they are level one. So I'm not complaining too much, but then the machine gunner kind of warms up. He's rolling and we're just off to the races. So I'm going to go ahead and send this next wave because I'm feeling pretty confident about that. Now, I'm going to actually focus on this next area here. So, I'm going to put a huge bulk of melee units right on these couple pads here. Now, once we get these guys all loaded up, once I can get a scatter shot, there we go. So, I'm going to go and stem them up, just getting ready, probably a little bit premature, a little early. But, hey, it's all good. Let me go ahead and send these waves here. Now, these waves are pretty locked down. I'm not going to lie. Let me go ahead and start kind of supporting a little bit more. Now, this is I'm going to start kind of loading up this area right here. This is pretty much a decoy until I can get my machine gunner all warmed up and ready to go. I'm pretty much going to be trying to just avoid too much craziness. I'm going to throw down firefighters, all that. Let me go ahead and flare them over a little bit. 
once we get the machine gunner we're just going to have him load up looks like we're clear on this side now as you can see getting a little hairy on this side but we almost have that machine gunner i'm gonna go and stem on my firefighters who are just holding down the fort over here for me we're about to get that machine gunner and then we're going to be off to the races so then once we get that i'm gonna throw down my machine gunner there we go i'm gonna go ahead and throw down a little molotov cocktail here to kind of work on taking out that little group of spitters right there start causing some damage for them getting pretty close gonna throw down one more desperado that's gonna finish off those runners for me couple drones coming in titan should be handled pretty nicely by that desperado drones just getting mowed down left and right did not stand a chance and i'm gonna go ahead and throw down this scatter shot to just finish off that mortician for the win so there we go that is the last attack i believe and we should be good on the assignment so as you can see at the bottom deploy 10 firefighters assignment complete go ahead and continue there show the rewards and we are good it's good stuff so there it is assignment complete we got some more coins as you can see there they are we got 10 coins that time i like it always open for more coins i like this because it's actually a really good source for coins so tomorrow if we came back and do two more we'll have that kind of finished up we'll get an uncommon pack and then we'll move on to the next one so there are a couple assignments i just want to kind of go through that and just kind of show off the assignments function the little new addition to the game but guys, thank you so much for watching. I really do hope you enjoyed. Um, but as always, um, make sure to like the video if you enjoyed it. Comment your thoughts. I love talking to you guys. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? I mean, come on. You want to join the nation. But guys, thank you so much as always. And I will see you guys in the next episode. See you guys.